one, the dynamic date filter app helps user to set a dynamic date filter on the sale order, purchase order, account invoice, lead, account move line, projects, HR and point of sale and so on. User can easily add or remove the filter using a checkbox for any of the model. Okay. At first, let's complete the configurations by setting a dynamic data filter. For that, we need to get into the settings. Under general setting, we have we can see the option name set dynamic date filter. We need to check this box to see these options. Okay. From here, user need to select the name and from here, we need to choose the model. From which model, we need these types of reports. So from here, we need to choose the model, whether it is the purchase order or it's sales order or else account means it is an invoice. So like this, you can select and uh, select from the drop down, you can see here. Okay. And from here, we need to select a filter field. So which field for which field we are going to filter these options. So I'm going to choose and creation date from here and under that user add or remove the filters by clicking on the filter checkbox like today, yesterday, last seven days, last 30 days, last 365 days. So like, like this, you can see those options. You can enable what else you need. Okay. So from here, once this is done, let me get into the sales. Okay. Let me save this one and get back to the sale order. Okay. So from here you can see a sales module. Let me get into that. User can select any of the filter from the filters which is available here. Okay, like the same you can see by using the current uh, that is creation date, it will be filtered. Like if uh, if it is a two days uh, today's order, so you can see only the today's order. If it is a yesterday's order, we can see only the yesterday's order. So last seven days orders can be seen and last 30 days order can be seen. Okay, like the same way we can see the orders by using the this week and also we can see the orders by using the last week. Okay, so these are the filters we have enabled. So in this way, we can make use of this dynamic date filter model in every model. Thank you for watching.